हे गाइज दिस इज सुभाषेष मिश्रा योर टेस्ट कोच टुडे वी लर्न ए जावा प्रोग्राम टू चेक इफ इट इज ए आमस्टंग नंबर सो व्हाट इज ए आमस्टंग नंबर फर्स्ट ए पॉजिटिव नंबर इज कॉल्ड आमस्टंग नंबर इफ इट इज इक्वल टू द सम ऑफ द क्यूब्स ऑफ इट्स डिजिट्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल जीरो वन वन फिफ्टी थ्री थ्री सेवेंटी थ्री सेवेंटी वन फोर जीरो सेवन सो ऑल दीज आर आमस्टंग नंबर लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड वाई वन फिफ्टी थ्री एंड थ्री सेवेंटी वन आर आमस्टंग नंबर सो फर्स्ट वन फिफ्टी थ्री राइट सो वॉट आई टोल्ड हियर आमस्टंग नंबर इज इक्वल टू द सम ऑफ क्यूब्स ऑफ इट्स डिजिट्स सो वन फिफ्टी थ्री राइट सो वॉट आर द थ्री डिजिट्स हियर वन फाइव एंड थ्री सो एवरी डिजिट्स विल फाइंड द क्यूब सो फॉर वन वन इंटू वन इंटू वन प्लस फाइव इंटू फाइव इंटू फाइव सिमिलरली थ्री इंटू थ्री इंटू थ्री एंड विल एड ऑल दिस नंबर्स सो हियर वॉट वी गॉट वन इंटू वन इंटू वन इक्वल टू वन फाइव इंटू फाइव इंटू फाइव इक्वल टू वन ट्वेंटी फाइव थ्री इंटू थ्री इंटू थ्री इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सेवन एंड फाइनली वी आर एडिंग ऑल दिस नंबर्स वन प्लस वन ट्वेंटी फाइव प्लस ट्वेंटी सेवन व्हिच इज इक्वल टू वन फिफ्टी थ्री सो दैट्स वॉट वी आर टेलिंग राइट ए पॉजिटिव नंबर इज कॉल्ड आमस्टंग नंबर इफ इट इज इक्वल टू द सम ऑफ द क्यूब्स ऑफ इट्स डिजिट्स so we understand how we will find if it is a armstrong number or not will individual digits will find cube of individual digits and we will add them if it is equal to the same number then it is a armstrong number similarly for 371 you can see 3 is cube 3 into 3 into 3 plus 7 into 7 into 7 plus 1 into 1 into 1 finally we got 27 plus 343 plus 1 which is equal to 371 that's why it is a armstrong number so let's go to our eclipse and write this program how to find a armstrong number so first i will create a new class new class i'll give the class name as armstrong okay then finish okay so what we'll do first we'll take a variable as number which is type integer and we'll give 153 we'll see that number is armstrong or not right we saw by our manual calculation it is a armstrong number by programmatically we'll check that then we'll take another variable as result type is integer and we'll assign value 0 to it then we'll take another variable as reminder okay then again we'll take another variable as temporary variable and will assign number to it we'll just tell int temp equal to number then what we'll do we'll write a while loop while number is greater than equal to 0 then the condition is reminder equal to norm divided by 10 then what we'll do norm equal to number divided by 10 then what we will do result equal to result plus what we'll write here reminder into reminder into reminder okay i'll explain why we are writing these things then we'll write a if loop and we'll write if result equal to temp then we'll tell sys out it is a armstrong number armstrong number else we'll say it is not not a armstrong number so now let's understand by executing it right first let's execute it and see what is the result we are getting we are getting it is a armstrong number so let's see how it is a armstrong number right first what we have done integer number equal to 153 we have taken the number then we have taken a result variable which we have assigned value as 0 then we have taken reminder to get the reminder and then we have taken a temporary variable and we have assigned the number so temporary variable value is 153 now then we are writing a while loop we are telling while number is greater than 0 what is the number value number value is 153 now right so condition is okay 153 is greater than 0 condition is correct so then what we are telling reminder equal to number 
divided by 10. So, we are finding the remainder. So, 153 rem divided by 10, if we will find the uh, remainder, so what will be the remainder here? It will be 3 because 153 by divided by 10, you will get uh, 15 and remainder as 3. And what we are doing here? Next, we are telling number equal to number by 10. So, number is 153, 153 by 10 equal to 153 by 10 equal to 15. So, we get number equal to 15 now and remainder equal to 3 now. Okay. Then, we are telling result equal to result plus. So, what is the earlier result value? Result value equal to 0. 0 plus what we are doing here? Then, we are telling remainder 3 into 3 into 3. So, what is the result? 3 into 3 into 3 equal to 27 plus 0. So, what we got? 27. Okay. Then, again our loop will go up because the number is 15 now and 15 is greater than 0. Then we came here. What is the remainder value? 15 divided 15 divided by 10. So, what remainder we got? We got remainder as 5. Okay. So, we can say here 15 divided by 10 we got remainder as 5. Here also what we got? Number equal to number by 10. Number equal to 15. So, 15 by 10 equal to 1. Okay, so here let me put it down. So, for this result, what we got? Result equal to result plus. So, earlier result value equal to 27 plus what we are trying to do here? A reminder is 5, 5 into 5 into 5. Right. So, how much we got? So, it will be 5 into 5 into 5, 125 plus 27, 152. Okay. Let me put a comma here. Again, the number value equal to 1. So, 1 is greater than 0. So, again loop will come inside. Reminder equal to number equal to 1. 1 divided by 10. What will get? Well, value is 1 divided by 10. So, 0 and we will get here 1. Similarly, here 1 divided by 10. What will get? We will get as 0. Here, then what will be the result here? Uh, earlier the result was 152. So, 152 plus 1 into 1 into 1, which is equal to 153. Now, when the loop will go, we have value equal to number equal to 0. So, 0 is greater than 0, condition will fail, will come down. If result equal to temp. So, what is the result value? Result value equal to 153 now. And what is the temp value? Temp value equal to 153. So, 153 equal to 153 condition succeed. So, we are telling it is a Armstrong number. And if condition will not succeed, we will tell it is not a Armstrong number. So, for example, if I will put 154, which is not a Armstrong number, let us run it and see. It is not a Armstrong number. So, like this, you can find if it is a Armstrong number or not. Thank you. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section. I will try to explain it. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel.